I've got another concealed carry style guide video for you and this time it's all about spring. Hey guys, what's up? I'm back. It's Emily from Style Me Tactical and I'm here with another video for you. If this is your first time, thank you, thank you so much for taking the time to watch. And if you're returning and a subscriber, I really appreciate you or your continued support and leaving me all the great feedback that um, you guys always do. You can find me at stylemetactical.com. You can also follow me on all my social media channels at Style Me Tactical. And of course, I would love it if you subscribe to my YouTube channel. You know, all that stuff is down below. Hit those buttons, give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. You guys were asking if I was gonna do a spring video and of course here I am. I'm not gonna let you down. You know I got you covered. And who doesn't love spring? It's my second favorite season. I love the extra hour of daylight that we get. I love the warmer weather. And I love that we get to start breaking out the open toed shoes, start wearing some short sleeves, ditching the heavy parkas for some cute little bomber jackets. Of course, I'm trying to get into the spring spirit with the floral and of course a little leather. So I'm gonna be bringing you all those spring vibes in 10 awesome spring ready outfits that are also perfect for conceal carrying this spring. Whoever said jeans couldn't be dressed up? When paired with a feminine and whimsy top, think about changing up your jeans and going for a pair that are high rise. This helps to reduce bulk around your waistline since the firearm will be sitting higher up on your torso than a standard mid-rise jean. A button down shirt is a great way to look polished but leaving one tail untucked makes it look effortless which also allows for quicker access to your firearm. For boyfriend style pants that tend to fit a bit looser around the waist, think about using a belly band style holster. This way you don't have to worry about the firearm weighing down your already loose pants. Graphic tees are such a fun way to express yourself and what makes them a great option for carrying is that the design distracts the eye and minimizes any hard lines your firearm might create from printing. Throw a blazer over top to elevate your look and you'll be ready for Sunday brunch. A utility chic army jacket is a modern essential that should be part of any woman's wardrobe. It can easily be layered over any style top or even a shift dress. And when worn as part of the outfit instead of for function, you can choose to carry a larger firearm or even change up your carry position. Bring a little spring into the workplace with a cute floral and ruffle top. I like grabbing my belly band style holster for work style pants. Since the fabric on these types of pants is typically lightweight, a standard holster and belt might weigh you down. A corset or belly band style holster keeps the lines clean without exposing any clips or belt. I love me a good vest, especially ones that have some movement to them. The waterfall front and loose style opens the door to additional carry positions which gives you options. If you change your carry position and change up your layers, make sure that you practice dry drawing and clearing your garment. Keep in mind that your layers will never clear the same way twice. You can't do spring without a cute lightweight trench, a versatile piece that can be worn casual or dressed up. You never know when those April showers may fall, so having a weather ready piece that's also cute is a win in my book. Don't let anyone tell you when you can or can't wear white. This is when having some holster options come in handy. You can easily go with a corset or belly band style holster, or as I chose, a holster that has a fabric clip. This clip securely attaches directly to your garment so there's no need to wear a belt. I love this style dress for shifting to spring weather. The ankle boots paired with a dress give this look a little bit of edge that I love. I broke out the thigh holster which in this dress makes my firearm easily accessible. However, this isn't the most comfortable carry position for me. If it's a position you choose, make sure you give it a dry one at home before stepping out. 
I can't let go of leather weather just yet, even if it's faux leather. My partial tuck of shirts is something that I've done since my pre-carry life and it's an easy trick to help create a little billowy pocket for your firearm to sit. Alternatively, you could add a tank top and wear it over your firearm if you have any concerns with printing. I hope you found some great style inspiration to take into spring. Of course, I'm gonna link all the concealed carry details, holsters, firearms, and my outfits will be linked on stomitactical.com as well as below. And if you have any questions with what you've seen here, you can leave a comment, you can reach me on the blog or on my social media channels at Style Me Tactical. And I love hearing from you and I love getting that feedback. So I wanna hear from you, reach out, let me know what you think. And so thank you so much for watching and until next time, enjoy your spring. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video and if you're... <laughs> what is the person that comes back? What is that called?